to our, our channel. channel. So like we promised, we're doing the seafood mukbang. Uh, we got it from Mr. and Mrs. Crab, where we yes. live in Florida. If you didn't know that. I don't know if you knew that, but uh, yeah. So what we have here is snow crab, green mussels, Yuck. shrimp with no head, sausage, egg corn potatoes, okay? Now, I'm hungry. Yeah, so we gonna dig right on in, y'all. So I'm gonna eat for a little while. I know we said we were gonna do like the whole how we met thing, but I don't know, that's just like, I don't know. We met and we're here today. That's how <laughs> I feel, you know what I mean? So I don't know what topic we're doing today. Whatever comes to our mind, that's what we're gonna do today. Okay, because I can't be scripted. We're it's just, just gonna eat and chill. Pretty much, hey guys, red cup. All right, oh, so. Yeah. Dig on in. So you didn't get me a fork, but this heifer got her a fork. So I'm probably you with my hands. You get a fork. No, I'm gonna do it gangster style. Okay. I'm gonna eat with my hands. Look at this potato, y'all. You could have got me a fork. This seasoning, man. If y'all ain't had Mr. Mrs. Crab, if y'all don't have Mr. Mrs. Crab in y'all area. <clears throat> Y'all missing out. <clears throat> this is really good. Mm. This is really, really good. Look how big the muscles are, guys. Let me give y'all a close up. Look how big. Ooh, I'm dripping. But look how big that <laughs> muscle is. I don't do muscles, y'all. She didn't do seafood to begin with. Just saying. I always like crabs. But you didn't do shrimp. I, and I didn't really do shrimp. Seafood and, and stuff like that. Yeah, but I've always liked crabs. Look at that. Look at that. I just recently started mm. eating shrimp. Mm. Like, I say, what, within the last year and a half? Right? Sure. I think I can eat shrimp every day of my life. Mm. This is damn good. Y'all. This is so good. So guys, they recently came to our area not too long ago. I remember the best seafood that I had tried was hot and juicy, but that's in Orlando, Florida. Mm -hmm. So that's about like two hours away from us if I'm driving an hour and a half if she's driving <laughs> to an hour. But anyway, but we would have to go there to get the seafood that I like, you know what I mean? And then this, this place came- seafood. And then, yeah, it was just, it was good. That's all I can say. Shrimp. Mmm. Mm -hmm. It ain't shrimp if you don't suck that juice out of it. I'm just saying. It's, it's, it's good. It's, it's very good. Yes, y'all. Dip it in that sauce and you just see it drip. Let me show y'all again. Hold on, slow motion. Oh. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Y'all, when I tell y'all, this is the business. This is really good. Look at that sausage. Mm. Messy, but good. Yeah, you got to get your hands dirty. She don't got the fork on tonight. You got to get your hands dirty. Excuse me, guys. <laughs> I got to get used to looking where I'm supposed to look. So, but she gonna talk about gotta get your hands dirty, but who got the fork? Well, my hands still dirty. Who got the fork though? Just saying. Look, don't come And you me. can't, when you dip, you can't just go boom and dip. You gotta like really just, mm, 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 Y'all see her trying mm. to come for me? Yeah, make it drip. Mm. It's good. Yes, Lord. It's delicious. Really delicious. Comment down below if y'all done had Mr. and Mrs. Crab, or if you have a Mr. and Mrs. Crab in your area. Here go. Look at this corn, y'all. Look at this. Ooh! Just good. 
just good. Mm. Really, really good. Just got to really dip it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Now, in the beginning of this video, I did get a clip of the food, more, you know, closer to you guys. Yeah, I was going to go. I'm going to get them seasoned in there. Yeah, I can see what we got going on. These are, this is good. Muscle. Look how big the muscle is. I'm going to dip it really good like that. Them things be looking so nasty. Mm. You can't knock something unless you try. I just can't bring myself to even try that. It just looked just mm-mm. You can't knock something until you try it. Right, guys? Mm-mm. Mm, this corn on point today. Me, personally, I don't think the shrimp look too much different than the than the mussel. But that's just my opinion. Just saying. No. The mussels don't look nothing like shrimp. Don't they come from the same place, though? Mm. And look, at least you don't see these little legs on the muscle. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> the muscles look like it's some type of, look like an organ. And what does shrimp look like? It don't look like an organ. They don't look like a testicle to y'all. <laughs> Ooh, you need to stop. I'm just saying. Mm -hmm. And I'm sorry for the smacking. But the only <laughs> way to really enjoy this type of meal is to smack it out. Okay? Yeah. Sausage. <clears throat> Big red cup. I'm doing water today, y'all. <clears throat> Yeah, so sausage. Mm-hmm. Look at this bad boy, y'all. Look at him. Mm-hmm. That don't look like an organ or something else too. <laughs> I'm just saying. No. Now look at this right here. Pull that hold that up again. Oh, you just let me get this him don't all look, why, how he's supposed to be. This don't look nothing like that. Look at that. That you looks like an organ. Like it just came right out of somebody's body. Come on, take a bite. Take a bite. Mm -hmm. Y'all know y'all want one. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at it. Y'all go ahead with that. I'm going to stick with my crab. Mm. Hold on. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Look at that. <clears throat> Mine mm -hmm. has a little kick to it. So you see me like... Yeah, I don't really do spice, y'all. So I'm clearing my throat and stuff. I begin mine with the no spice. But I think I, I like got some spice. of your juices over here because it did a little something to me my last bite. I love spicy. I'm not even supposed to have spicy. But we're not supposed to do a lot of things in life, right? Oh, no. Ain't nothing in there. So, I have a topic. What's that? How did y'all feel about the kids being homeschooled? All right, well, your kids are with you all the time. Now, she works from home. I go out to go to work. So technically, she's been dealing with it. So maybe she could speak, speak on that topic of how she feel. That ain't no joke. I know I'm with him for all of 30 seconds and I'm already don't have patience. I mean, mm, delicious y'all. Mm. So how you feel about that? 
I mean, it was rough in the beginning. But our kids, they're more self-sufficient. They can do a lot more by themselves. I don't see how these people do when they got like elementary kids. Because mm. that's a 20, like that's, that's you gonna have to sit there and really help them through everything. And then, as you guys know from our update video that we did earlier, we have a one-year-old. So not only is she working from home, have three teens and a one-year-old, you gotta worry about the damn dog barking. Yeah, every that, two that seconds. That 19 then ruined up a lot of stuff and messed up a lot of stuff. Yeah. But we're trying to get back in the swing of things. Things are slowly opening back up. I ain't going. Yeah, we ain't going. We gonna give it some. They more can time. open up slow. They can open up fast. They can they can do whatever they want to do. But I'm good, right here where I'm at. Okay, y'all feel me? Sip on that red cup on that one. Excuse me, y'all. Yeah, excuse you. My hands dirty. And look, she the one had the fork. I'm not even using it. I know how to keep my hands clean. All right, let's do this. Let's, let, you let's, keep trying to come for me. Ain't nobody coming for you, girl. Well, what did it mean to this egg? It just looked like an egg. <laughs> I, I don't understand. Well, let's see how it tastes. Yeah, I want a piece of the potato. Look, look at that sauce. Look at that sauce. Mm. Look at that sauce. Mm. See, I like my sauce just dripping. Look at that, y'all. Ooh, wee. I just had a moment, y'all. Mm. Mm. Look at that. <laughs> I thought you know how to keep your hands clean. Watch this. Amazing. I still see it all over your hand. She's a hater. <laughs> she is a hater. Rape. Oh, this is so spicy. It ain't that spicy, y'all. I'm just being dramatic. That's all. No, she is often very dramatic. So you feel like, back to the subject, you feel like it was easier with older kids. Yeah, definitely. But what about the older kids that struggle with learning? I mean, that, you got to take all that into consideration as well. But I'm just saying, like, if you have a more self-sufficient children then like in the, it, initially starting anything is going to be difficult it's going to be an adjustment regardless and so in the beginning it was hard i ain't gonna lie it was hard i was stressed out to the max every day and more so stressed out because she would text me guys at work and tell me why she was stressed out more so because of the system itself wasn't working that's what what she was really more so stressed out about so you got three kids basically telling you they can't do crap because <laughs> It's not working. Then you got teachers expecting them to do crap and it's not working. But I must admit that their teachers were pretty understanding. Well, yeah, they were. They, they teachers were pretty understanding. And even my job was understanding too. Like, they know it's a whole pandemic going on. So they know everything's shut down. They know daycare's closed. They know school is closed. They know we doing it from home. So it was all understanding. No, I got my little glimpse of it. I'm going to tell y'all my point. <laughs> I got my little gifts because my job had me go down to four days. I still got paid for my five days, but I went down to four days, like physically being there. So when I would come home for, and have that day off during the week and they still have school. <laughs> Do you lose your train of thought? No, I didn't lose it. <laughs> I pause because I don't see how she does it. Y'all, she tell me every day she don't know how I do it. I almost lost my mind. I almost, I, I, listen, I almost told everybody they can go you know where. And, and that one day, I only had one day with them, y'all. <laughs> I was, I, I, I said, how the hell? I got the one year old crying. I got them telling me about technical difficulties. Yeah, y'all, it was a mess. 
And guess what I'm doing while she over there stressing out with it. <laughs> I'm laughing. <laughs> I was just like, I had a whole tantrum. Like, you ever seen a kid that's fall out? I fell out. I was like, I can't do this. I don't understand. She said, I'm going to work. I'm going to work. I'd rather go make money. Just goodbye. I'll see you later. Like, I'm just... I think we done switched roles, honestly. Because there was a time where she didn't have patience for, like, homework. Nothing. This was when they were, like, in elementary. She had no patience for that. Like, she would be sitting at the same table with our 30-year-old girl and literally scream oh you better come get because i can't i can't handle it so I, I think we done switched where now she has like more patience and I, i've always had like zero patience but for for some reason when it came to schoolwork i was always patient so you had and, to and understanding to the fact that they just didn't get it at that time she just felt like come on it's, it's easy let's get yeah, it yeah i didn't have patience for it and i'm like I know it's easy, but we have to, they're learning it. But, yeah. So, look at that, y'all. Oh, look at that. Looks empty. <laughs> <laughs> okay. But, yeah, so, I can give her my mad props because I couldn't do it. I could not do it. I was losing patience with a one-year-old, y'all. <laughs> Me and her almost had it out. She had me second guessing myself. Like, am I meant and built to be a parent? Like, oh, these kids are something else, honey. And, and so y'all patience then went drastically down as time has gone by. Right. And then it's like, as they get older, they got their own personality. So we got, we got, Honestly, I'm going to say seven personalities in the house because the dog got her own personality too. <laughs> and um, it's just sometimes it don't mix. And let's just keep it 100. Let's keep it 100. Like, this don't mix sometimes. Girl. You don't... Oops. <laughs> you know, I said I was clean earlier, right? She coming out. Y'all see this what she just did? Mm -hmm. Now that don't make no. Okay. I don't need you to wipe it off me. I'm trying to help you. No, don't help me. That wasn't my fault. That was the crab. No, that was you. That, that was, was you. Mm. But anyway, like I was saying before, I was rudely juiced the one. <laughs> I said, "Oops." But yeah, sometimes it doesn't work. Too much personality. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you just gotta have a moment to yourself. Mm-hmm. I'm not here in my moment. And recuperate. And when I get in my little mood, <laughs> everybody mm. just need to stand down. Houston, we have a problem. Major one. But I wouldn't trade my kid in the world. I mean, I wouldn't trade my kid in for another kid ever. <laughs> Every last one on. Mm. I want y'all to know I washed my hands with antibacterial soap before I just started licking all of my hands, okay? I don't want to hear nothing. Just saying. Just saying, y'all. Just saying, y'all. Woo! Y'all, you be so you ever be so hungry? That your eyes is bigger than what your stomach really can take. Because I'm full. And I feel like I ain't even ate nothing. What you ate? I don't remember. I think you've been over here dipping in my side. No, I haven't. Why your napkin pile look bigger than mine is? <laughs> Normally, you be using all the napkins. Yeah, she had a napkin hoarder. She called me a whore what? Hoarder. Oh. <laughs> Try to call me some more slide, y'all. But yeah, let me so, try not to juice you again. Online schooling was something else. 
And I can only imagine, like she said, for the parents that kids are younger, Ooh. that need that help, or even an older kid that just, you know, we don't all learn, we don't all learn the same. Right. And, um, there's older kids that even need the assistance. Not to say like they're not smart or anything. It's just they need that extra boost. They need that extra help. And for a parent to become the actual primary teacher almost, it's like, whoa. I mean, we, are, we as parents are teachers anyway. Yeah, but right. they have it all day while you trying to work too. Cause no, no. Let's be honest. Let's be honest. When they go to school, we be happy as hell. <laughs> Let's be real, okay? We ain't gotta worry about the ABCs. We ain't gotta worry about the one, two, three. We ain't gotta worry about breakfast and lunch. What we do at home is re snack. You know, let me get it up. Breakfast, lunch, snack. What we do at home is recap what the teacher done already told them when they get in school. So not the teacher and the parent working hand in hand with each other. But then it's hard on the parent because you know, you got the teacher in your corner. It ain't hard as on the teacher because you got the parent in your corner. So it kind of just work out and it be like less stress. But, baby. That baby, day, baby, baby. That fifth day that I was supposed to be at work and I was home. Mm. I don't even think it was the older kids. I don't even think it was online school. And I think it was the one-year-old. <laughs> I really do. I think that was the issue. That was really it. Don't come for my baby like that. Let's just be honest. You've created a monster. Mm -mm. She's created a monster. Mm -mm. Look at that corn, y'all. All that she's doing. Oh, Jesus. I don't know what I'm going to do right now. I'm going to try to eat this corn, but it got like a lot going on. <laughs> I'm going to wipe that off a little bit. Y'all see that? I'm gonna dip it a little bit in a little juice. Okay. Okay. All right now. That's how we do it, y'all. But is this yours? Who the hell knows? You can't reach. I told y'all I should eat my shit. No, I mean, this was way. This was way over here. I think that's yours. You didn't eat your crab yet, did you? I ate one piece of it. You keep taking my stuff. Okay, that's yours. You, you keep, put it over here. You keep taking my stuff. I don't know why you want to eat my food. You don't like it spicy. It's spicy. I'm not trying to eat it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. this is so juicy. This corn is pretty good. I told you the corn on point. Mm-hmm. Pretty good. Look at that juice. It's good. Yeah, y'all. I think we about done. Mm -hmm. About tapped out. Mm -hmm. This is going to be my last crab leg. Mm -hmm. I think. Mm-hmm. 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 <laughs> it just be so good. I just want to keep going. Going and going and going. Sure. Mm. So... I believe our next mukbang mukbang is gonna be spaced out from this one, guys. Cause like I said, y'all ain't gonna make me gain weight. <laughs> this is our first time eating today, so yeah. Yeah, like we said, we're trying to go the opposite direction. The opposite direction. So it's gonna be spaced out. The next one though is gonna be Jamaican food. Oh, I want some oxtails and some cabbage. Look at that, y'all. All that good stuff. Oh, that do it look good. I'm gonna put a little juice on it for you. That one look good. You want it? No, I ain't gonna take it from you. I'm gonna be nice. Look at that, y'all. Ooh, dripping, dripping. Is this my corn? Mm-hmm. But you oh. Why my corn gotta have all the <laughs> I was gonna say you can have this one. 
And it's all good. I'm gonna get it off. Y'all know how when it's, it, it cooks in that boil and the season it'll be stuck on it. Like it'll be caked up and it'll be too like, so you gotta get it off then you dip it in the sauce. Yeah, that's what, that's what is going on. I normally like to get my sauce on the side, but cause I like to dip. Dip, dip baby, dip. dip. Oh, you know, you know. <laughs> get out my head. Get out my head. Can I have a napkin? Can you give me that napkin? Since you just took all the napkins. Y'all. The struggle is real. I'm trying. I don't even want this. <laughs> I do want this corn though. This corn is good. Mm. Mm. We always run out of mm. napkins, y'all, when we mm. eat this dish. Mm. <coughs> yeah, right. Are you okay, girl? Mm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Woo, this is delicious. Mm -hmm. I'm a picking eater too. And I love this place. Mm. Y'all. I think I'm I'm oh I ain't did I I ain't open one of these. These people think I don't even know how to eat crab. You playing around with the crab. I'm full. I am full. There we go. You see that? Bring it up close to y'all. Look at that. That is delicious. Alright. Mm. There's still meat on that part. We're gonna get them now. <laughs> that on, that, go ahead on and get him. He kind of was tripping. I think I'm done, y'all. Well, I think we're done. They were pretty much tapped out. It was delicious. Yes, it was. Again, this is Mr. and Mrs. Crab. <sighs> delicious. If you don't got one in your area, I'm sorry. But if you got a hot and juicy in your area. Yeah, that's a, it's equivalent. A it's equivalent. To yeah, this. it's good too. So, yeah, but yeah, I can see how much we have left here. Yeah, we don't never finish our bags when we get them. It's just, it's a lot of food. Yeah, but it'd be lot. so good. It'd be really good. But, so guys, the next video will be coming. Uh, we're not going to really say what days videos will be coming or anything like that. Because we got to get situated. Yeah, we, we got to really work out a plan and all that. Yet. You know what I mean? And as long as I sit here, I'm going to eat something. But, yeah. But I can tell you our next mukbang, mukbang, however they say it. It's going to be the Jamaican food because I want some oxtails with some um, cabbage. Yeah, she's been talking about this for a minute, y'all. I've been craving it. I've been craving it. So that's probably going to be the next mukbang. Yeah. We'll come up with another topic as well um, for that. I kind of like doing the topics just off, the, off our head. Like, I don't like really like saying, okay, this is what this video is going to be about. And like trying to record it. Mm -hmm. You know how like, we just did the online kid. I didn't think we were gonna do that topic, but we did. And well, yeah. yeah. Um, comment down below. Let us know if you liked it. If you want to see any more mukbangs from us, or what else you want to see from us. And let's get this going, y'all. Now she said the muscles looks like a look at these legs. That's a girl. Bye. Look, look. It look like he just came out, crawled out the shell, and go to find another shell. Girl. To crawl into or something. Okay, we done. Goodbye. Okay. Let's go. All right. Hey, make sure you like, subscribe, press that notification bell, click the all. Leave your comments down below. Leave your comments down below. We are out.